up to. There's this up to fallacy, or I don't even know if we want to call it a fallacy, uh, but it's a way that some people trick other people. And it is by saying that, uh, you know, if you want a lot of something, then the person who's claiming to be willing to provide it will say that they will give you up to that amount. So an example would be if you go to a hotel and the hotel says that they have internet speeds of up to 50 megabytes per second. They're not guaranteeing that they will be 50. They'll, they're saying that that's the highest that it will ever be. They might also be like a, a recent hotel I stayed in in uh, Logan, not Logan, Utah, Preston, Utah, home of uh, Napoleon Dynamite. I stayed at the Plaza Motel there, the only place in town. And uh, they, <laughs> their internet was something like, when it was on, it was on most of the time, but when it was on, it was something like 0.78 megabytes per second. So they could have had one big burst at one point where it was two megabytes per second. And then they would say, we provide internet speeds up to two megabytes per second. Well, in fact, during the time I was there, the internet didn't work most of the time. When it did work, it was that very slow 0.78. So when a store tells you, here's another example, store says, we have discounts up to 90% off on our products. Well, they might have one product that's 90% off. Maybe that's a, a single bottle of water, and it's usually a dollar, and they're selling it for 10 cents. So they're selling it for basically what they're paying for it. Um, so it's up to 90% off. Well, the other 99% of stuff is probably discounted to 10% or 5%, but that's what gets you in the door. So I'm calling for my big suggestion, my central planning, what I think should happen. I think it would be really nifty if uh, a bunch of people, business owners, got together and when they advertised, they would give a minimum and a maximum of, of what it is that they provide and say, you know, this is the outlandish bottom. This is the outlandish top. Usually it's somewhere in the middle. So perhaps the hotel would say, you know, usually our Internet is right around the 20 megabytes per second uh, range, but we have had it as low as three. That's the lowest it's ever been. We promise it will always be above three. And there have been a number of times that it's been up to 100. That's honesty right there. Why don't more businesses do that? Why don't more businesses respect you, not have contempt for you, but respect you and do that? Uh, that seems to me like it would be a great, great move for public relations reasons, maybe other reasons too. Uh, that just seems like a good, honest thing to do. And I'm going to take that advice myself and make sure that my business does not offer things that it, it doesn't do. And actually... I already know that it doesn't. We've been very careful to make sure that people get more than what they pay for when they come out with us. We're very expensive, our services, but we charge a lot and we give a lot and we give more than the people expected. So we promise this level, we give that level and we keep the price the same and it's all inclusive. So I guess I don't need to examine myself so much on that, but I wish other businesses would do it. So. To wrap up, keep your eyes open for this up to fallacy, this up to trick. Don't, don't let them fool you on this. Don't let them get up to that kind of business on you. 